Hey everyone, Pamper Chef Michelle here. Welcome to my kitchen. And tonight I am using one of our brand new, um, Pamper Chef has made them available earlier, our meal starter sauces. Uh, and they're available as of yesterday, August 1st. Uh, the meal starter sauces uh, come in three flavors. They're $15 each or 35 for the set of three. Um, ginger sesame, beef bourguignon, which is what I'm gonna be using tonight, and also a bolognese. All you need to do is add these sauces um, to your meat and vegetables or just vegetables if you want to have a vegetarian dinner. And you can do it in your quick cooker, your pressure cooker, your slow cooker, and you can even use it on your stove. They're just really quick and easy, flavorful sauces to make dinner a snap. So I'm making beef bourguignon tonight. Um, what I've got going here is my quick cooker. I've turned it on to sear. This is one of my favorite things that I can brown my meat um, in the same vessel I'm gonna cook in. So I've got some oil heating here down below. I have uh, about one and a half pounds of chuck roast cubed. Now my chuck roast did not, um, was not cubed when I picked it up in the store. Sometimes you, I can't find it that way. And what I do, I'm gonna move this, start searing this in the, um, the quick cooker there. What I do when I have a situation like that that I need to chop up some meat into, into cubes, I stick it in the freezer for about an hour and or I take it out, don't let it thaw all the way, and then I cut it when it's partially frozen because it's a much easier to cut, especially if you want like really thin strips of steak or really small pieces of chicken. It's so much easier to cut after you have um, frozen it just a little bit, the meat firms up. So I'm gonna let this brown here for a second. I'm gonna move away this cutting board because it's had raw meat on it. I want to move it out of my way. Safety first always, right guys? Okay, so these um, these starter sauces are great. This is actually my first evening trying them. I've heard such rave reviews and I cannot wait to try this. And so it's a nice special meal. Normally making a sauce like beef bourguignon would take a long time and it's gonna be a snack. So I'm continuing to sear my meat. And while that's doing its thing, I'm gonna talk a little bit more about what we're doing here. And sneak peek at some items that are gonna be available everyone next month, but they're available to August Host. And I have a couple days left this month if you really want this. This month um, in August, Host gets 60% off at anything in the catalog and there's special quick cooker sets. Um, so I'm showing you the quick cooker tonight. If you already have a quick cooker, you can get all the accessories for just $72 when you host. If you want a quick cooker, you can get the quick cooker and all the accessories I'm about to show you or talk about for $168. That's a 420 value. It's an amazing deal. This is the time to get in. I use my quick cooker two to three times a week. I've used it a lot this summer because it doesn't heat up my kitchen. Um, and I use it a lot um, when we're busy with school, I forget to pull out meat to thaw, and you can cook from frozen um, right here in your quick cooker. So let me move this around a little bit more. So let me talk to you about the accessories that are going to come with your quick cooker. Um, the accessories you can get are, I pulled them all out now, I can't find them. Um, this rack that goes at the bottom that you can hold your ceramic pot in, hold it above so you can cook. Uh, meat below and veggies or greens in your ceramic pot top is oven safe as well. It comes with a nice um, silicone lid. You also get a set of two of these racks. I just have one right here. I'm pulling out so much stuff, you guys. These racks, there's two of them. They each hold three of these prep cup bowls, which you'll also get with these special silicone lids. You can make nice little custards in there. I make um, Starbucks coffee cat sous vide egg bites in here. You put these on. You can make up to six at a time or two dozen eggs can stand on these racks uh, right there in your quick cooker. You you will also get, and now it's time for the fun stuff. You're also going to get these things that are available to everyone next month and only to host this month. A special pan so you can make a bunt. A, fluted, a small fluted pan that holds about five cups of batter. A bunt right there in your quick cooker has this rack to allow you to, to lower it down and so this will sit on the bottom. This is the one I love. Steamer baskets, all right? Right now, I have my ingredients, my potatoes, and my carrots in here. You can use them individually in your quick cooker or you can stack them. Imagine, you can steam some salmon on the bottom and your broccoli on the top and your quick cooker 
all at once. I'm so excited for these babies. So these are available to host only this month and everyone starting September 1st. All right, so my beef is seared in here. So the next thing I'm gonna do is I am going to add my carrots. That is about a half pound of carrots. And the recipe calls for small red potatoes. I got these potatoes from my CSA. I can't wait to eat them. They were a little uh, uneven in size, so I chopped them down so they're about the same size. So they'll cook the same. Put those in. And now my beef bourguignon. Pour that in. Let me swing this around so you can see what I'm doing. All right, I'm pouring that into my quick cooker. And then one cup of water. And folks, that's dinner. I'm gonna give this a little bit of a stir just to get things evenly distributed in here. And then I'm gonna put my quick cooker lid on. No, oh, that's in quite the song. Now, I'm gonna turn off, I should have done that before. I'm turning off the sear function. And then what I'm going to do is I always check my buttons at the top. I make sure this is flush because when you release the steam, it sticks down. Make sure that's flush and make sure this is seated properly because sometimes it gets twisted. If either one of those are set, when you do it, it's never gonna to come to pressure because steam is gonna be released here. Okay, and then we're gonna set it to the, the um, soups and stew setting and click start. And in about 30 minutes, with very little effort from me, my family's gonna have beef bourguignon. It's gonna be tender. That chuck roast that's typically a tough cut of meat is gonna be tender. The carrots and potatoes and all that's gonna to stew together with that sauce. I've got some rice cooking here. I'm gonna make up some greens for myself because I don't like the carbs. And we will be having a sumptuous feast with such little effort. Can you imagine coming home from work, zip, zap, zop, throw it in and go spend time with your family instead of spending time over the stove for the next 30 minutes. I will see you soon and talk to me about hosting in August. You want that quick cooker because now's the time to jump on it. Bye.